This video was brought to you by viewers like you. Consider supporting us on Patreon. I was just a small American YouTuber living in Japan. Then one day, I met these crazy Aussie guys. Turns out, they too were YouTubers. Big YouTubers. Cool. We went on a Japanese adventure. Six months later, they asked me to come visit them in Australia. It was fun. Lots of fun! Even though I was having so much fun, I eventually had to leave and go back to my life in Tokyo. Then a year later, the guys called me up. They said they had a movie that they wanted to sell in Hollywood, and they wanted me to come with them. So I got rid of all my stuff, quit my job, and hopped on a plane. Now I'm here with my friends once again, and I've decided I'm going to be filming everything that doesn't make the cut in their videos to show you what it's like being a real-life entourage member of one of the most controversial and fastest-growing talents in show business today. Welcome to Raka Behind the Scenes. Oh, my fucking dick! Hey guys, I just wanted to dip in right before I started this video and just say thank you all. Thank you so many new subscribers recently. Hello, thank you. And uh, I just wanted to say I hope you guys really like this be Rocka Behind the Scenes series. It uh, holds a very special place in my heart and I hope you guys enjoy it too. And stay tuned till the end of the video for the awesome sexy message. Yeah, buddy! <laughs> Yeah, guys, so the thing is is that there were so many fights. You guys think that all the fights are really choreographed and thought out? That's like half the time. The other half of the time, they just kind of wing it. Anyway, enjoy this clip. Okay. That's kind of horny. I'll go on this side. Let me and Daniel this side because I just want to be on the side of the camera. And action. Hang on. It's time. For the face off! Oh. Hey, Jackson, Jackson. That's right. Oh, I fucking start blocking my door with shit. <laughs> the whole This is one of the eight occasions you've just walked in and woken me up in the mornings. Yep. I'm gonna fuck you up tomorrow. I'm gonna get up at like 4 a.m. Oh, that's hot. That's hot. <laughs> yeah, guys, and also there's not as many trains here as there was in Tokyo, so we drive everywhere. We have driven all the way from middle of California to southern California to northern California. We're going everywhere. Who said we're ready for a car montage? I wish I could say what a wonderful feeling We're on the upswing like we're punching the ceiling But nothing is feeling like anyone has any fun Put their paws on You go tell them that they go and lit up with their paws on Put them on the battlefield so they quit And you know when they get such fun I'm Choo 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 and then I'm one uh, gets to his feet We can't Because the video's not out, Sam I'm not doing anything. What are you talking about, Danny? This phone just happens to be on camera mode, and that red button doesn't mean anything right there. Seven is a college town that is Whittier College, where Nixon went to school. It's some nice, it's a nice house right there, that brick house, dream house. Dream house. Yeah, I've just been taking like driving shots of like 
all the different areas we go through. Track. Was once your name, my alum on all the track. Realized I forgot to call you back. Here's that autograph for your daughter. I wrote it on the starter cap. Boom! Say it, say it, son. Listen, man. Yeah, guys, anyway, I don't know, it's so funny. The first time that we've gotten stopped by fans, it was actually for me at the Avis Rental Car Agency. But, you know, the funny thing is, is that those guys, you know, Jackson, and Christian, you know, fucking all the Rocka boys, they've actually, when they get stopped, they get stopped by fans. They have fans all over the world, and it's just crazy that we'll go somewhere and then they'll just get stopped in the middle of us leaving a shop. Boom. How the hell do you guys get away with doing all that stuff? Like jumping inside the window, just doing a bounce, <laughs> just doing a bounce. Yeah. Dude, I'm like, you guys do an awesome job. Like yeah. seriously, it was so funny. I've like literally have been watching you guys, and you guys are sitting there on TikTok. Time. On TikTok. Rocka boys trying ramen. Oh. Can we call security on this random man filming us? <laughs> I hit leave until I get the shot. It's over! Look at Mike, he's gonna try ramen for the first time since leaving Japan. Even though, all, even though all they did in Japan was eat Taco Bell and not eat any Japanese food. What about? If I don't know how to awesome. eat Chinese food, Sam, how can I use chopsticks so well? Ooh. Because you have sex with Asian women. Hey, you're freaking me out there. Kind of like this freak show we went to. Check it out. Then bam, the freak show clips. Hey everybody, uh, thank you, thank you for making it all the way to the end of this video. This has been a pet project that I wanted to get off since I first moved to LA and now we finally got to do it. I don't know, you guys get to see such a pristine and like clean and very short, a kind of non-humanable version of uh, these guys, the Rocket guys and the other fucking big YouTubers that we hang out with. And you know, I want to show you guys, I want to share what's going on with me behind the scenes because like you know this has been this is like you know a normal dude getting you know being able to go into hollywood with his hollywood celebrity friends it's like that is what it feels like in 2019 this is the closest thing that comes to that kind of feeling and i don't know i just want to say thank you so much for coming along with me on the ride here uh, right down in the comment section if you you know did you like it did you not like it um were the scenes too long uh trust me this is just uh, i kind of did this very last minute because we have about five other things that we need to be doing and I just kind of threw it up all, all over there because the intro took me too long to make but anyway um, yeah you know hit that like button hit the, hit the dislike button whatever you want to do uh, you know I want your feedback on this and uh, yeah guys um, I want to say hello to all the new subscribers, hello to all the old subscribers, I still love you all equally, uh, but anyway, uh, make sure to go and check out the, for all the new subscribers, go ahead and check out my backlog of TKO rants and old TKO vlogs, I'm pretty sure you might like it. Uh, anyway, also big shout out to Patreon, uh, the TKOSAM.com, or wait, no, the Patreon.com slash TKOSAM. Big thank you and shout out to everybody that's been going over there, and especially big shout out to everybody who's been coming over to my live streams on my Tikyo Sam live channel. Guys, oh, it's so fun to hang out with you. Probably by the time I upload it, I will be live streaming. So guys, go check, I'll post the link as a comment down below. Go check it out, it's fucking amazing. Um, 
I swear it is fucking amazing. Anyway, uh, yeah, thank you all. A big shout out to A Devoid and Jason over at Patreon, some of the top tiers over there. Uh, yeah, guys, if you want to support the channel, you want some cool rewards like a blog, uh, like about my whole experience here, or Japanese lessons, or even a consultation if you're moving over to Japan, that and tons more options over there. And, uh, you know, you'll be supporting the channel. I don't know what you're doing here if you don't want to support the channel besides watching the video. Anyway, it's going on too long. I got to get out of here. But thank you guys so much, and I'll see you on the next one. Boom, stay black. Yeah. Woo. Dad.